All right, do you ride? For most people, fun is the only motivation needed. For our next guests, it's about fundraising. The Blue Knights are made up of more than 20,000 active members, hundreds of chapters in two dozen countries. Our guests are part of Nebraska Chapter 2 Active Omaha Police Officers Corey Clements. Jake Patine is over here as well. And David Smith is a retired U.S. Air Force and Veterans Affairs police officer. Good Hi to see guys. you nice all three you this morning. So, 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 like, can I skip the officer? Because you're in jeans, and I feel yes, like now we're first absolutely. name basis today. <laughs> yeah. you know? And again, black. We're all in black. <laughs> So, that was planned. Thanks, guys. Uh, but why are you why are you part of this? Uh, and your members are here locally, right? Correct. Yeah. That's so right. explain the organization. Uh, it's made up of active and retired law enforcement officers that like to give back to the community. Mm -hmm. uh, we enjoy riding motorcycles. We promote motorcycle safety, and and this is just another way that we can uh, we can give back. Mm -hmm. Jake, what are the requirements for membership? Uh, only requirement is that you are an active duty or retired law enforcement officer mm -hmm. uh, that rides a motorcycle. Uh, no preference on what type of motorcycle, uh, just that uh, you ride one and you want to come out, have some fun and help us fundraise uh, for some great organizations locally here in our, our state. Yeah, how many members do you have around this area? So we have uh, three chapters in uh, Nebraska. Uh, in our chapter, we call Chapter 2, we have about 62 members right now mm -hmm. representing about 15 agencies. And that's uh, agencies from city all the way up to the federal right, level. Like your Omaha police. Omaha mm -hmm. police. But you might have some FBI. Uh, from our oh, yeah, is that I don't possible? know if we have FBI. We have we, an FBI. We, we do. Should we do? do? No. Okay, well, there you I go. Think we've and got then, an office down the road here. Uh, yeah, Veterans Affairs, Police Department, mm -hmm. um, County Sheriff. And some uh, of your members have been recognized for not just being members of the group, but for going above and beyond. Absolutely. So um, every organization, people are doing great things. And so naturally, with 15 agencies representative, um, people are doing great things every day, so uh, naturally that, that mm -hmm. goes hand in hand. Well, you're talking about doing great things. You raise money for charities. Which charities are you guys supporting right now? Well, <laughs> um, we, support, uh, we support the, law, the Nebraska Law Enforcement Memorial um, Fallen Officer Family Fund, mm -hmm. and we also support the Veterans Affairs where we have our own personal program that we've dubbed Shop with a Night. Mm -hmm. We're with the Veterans Affairs Hospital. We get with them and we pick out a disabled veteran and his family. What is this like? Because, you know, we, at the holidays we hear about like shop with a cop where you guys yep. go out with kiddos. But when you have veterans who are going on a trip and, and they're picking things out, what is yep. that like? Oh, it, it's very inspirational and it, it helps the veterans out also because when we take them out, we have a very big group of guys that come out with us mm -hmm. um, and do that. We This last time that we went out, we went to Walmart, we took a veteran out there. We had his social worker there. Mm -hmm. Um, he was overwhelmed mm. with all the support and everything. Um, he very rarely talked, even in his counseling sessions and everything, mm -hmm. and he opened up to us. Mm. She was amazed wow. at what he was doing, how we were treating his kids, his family. And uh, at the end of the night, we went also out, took him out to eat. Mm -hmm. And they said it, it just was really great for him. And afterwards, at the counseling sessions back at the hospital, he just started opening up so really big So it was a transformative day, and it wasn't about the day, it sounds mm -hmm. like. You changed his life. Oh, yes. Yeah. yeah, and and I speak with him on a weekly basis now, mm -hmm. passing at him, and and he thanks us every day for what we did. That's and that's great. just the one. That's just one of the programs. Mm -hmm. you that's guys just have. one of the programs. Yeah, yeah. that's mm -hmm. great. And then we put the website at the bottom of the screen. So if you're as you're watching, if you want to look up some of the other stuff, you can do that. But uh, when's the next ride? Next ride is the uh, big dam. Uh, river ride. Is this <laughs> and it's to support. <laughs> well, we've, we've got a graphic for that too. So Jay, that is spell. this a place or is it a play on words? Uh, no, this is a place we ride up to uh, <laughs> <laughs> Gavin's Point Dam, um, uh -huh. and it's for the Madonna School. Uh -huh. uh, to benefit Tell us about. Well, we we know because we've had him on the show. Some of our viewers yeah. might know. Right. If they don't. Uh, what is it about this cause that you wanted to dedicate some time to it and give them some money? This is more close to you. Yeah. Well, uh, we help them raise money to uh, fund. Uh, supplies and things that they need for the mm -hmm. school. Mm -hmm. uh, the organizer, uh, Mitch, has been in touch with us at recent meetings and mm -hmm. those are some of the things that, they're, that they need and we're happy to help them out with that. Mm -hmm. yeah. They it's do the, some awesome work, don't right. they? Right, it's pretty cool, yeah. it's pretty cool. The, it's the big damn river ride and you can find about it <laughs> on the website at the bottom screen. But no, May is, uh, is Motorcycle Safety Awareness Month, so while we have you here, um, what do you recommend, not only for um, uh, the s motorcyclists out there, but even for drivers who yeah. are driving on the street or on the same road? And then yeah. when you guys get a big group together, how do you keep safety in mind? We actually have a, a pre-ride brief. We have a road captain who makes sure that uh, we know point A to point B where we're going. Uh, we discuss our route and we make sure that uh, we, we follow the procedures of alternating motorcycles mm -hmm. so that we have room to stop, uh, take action if we need to, mm -hmm. to remain safe. And, and again, 
we're, we're trying to get, with maybe Motorcycle Safety Awareness Month, we're, distracted driving is a major problem. I mean, it's, uh, they, you know, it's equivalent to drunk driving, so we want people to look twice, save a life, and, mm -hmm. uh, and be aware that distracted driving is dangerous to everybody. You know, yeah, we've had Rob Reynolds on the show this week. Well, yeah, we did, and you're doing a lot of things just to promote uh, you know, safe motorcycle riding, safe driving. And mm -hmm. I see these guys zipping up Dodge on these, what they call them, crotch rockets, doing bikes, wheelies. Yes. Mm -hmm. I mean, you, that's everything it that goes against what you're saying. That's that's everything that's 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 Jake, I see you doing that on that Harley. I'm yeah, going to call your mother. Um, what do we see video of here? Is this part of the skills? It is. It's part event? of the, the River City Motor Skills uh, uh, training and competition. It's. Mm -hmm. uh, not only we give back to the community, we give back to the officers in the community, and this yeah. provides them an opportunity to do continued training. Uh, it sharpens them their skills. Uh -huh. It makes them a better motor officer and better rider. And that next event is in August? It is. August yeah. 27th. August yeah. 27th. Uh -huh. yeah. But that's more an opportunity also for the public to come out and see how these motorcycles can move, be able to meet some of the officers that uh, navigate those. Um, but also for the children, we have bounce houses and Sure. And face painting and all that fun well, stuff. And then, and then Mike, families. what's coming up before that, though? What, do, what event is coming up before this one? Which one? Big Dan. I was well, giving you another oh. lane. <laughs> Listen, <laughs> it's all online. You guys have a nice website, by the way. Thank you, you know, hey, Is that where people should that. go um, to learn about everything you're doing throughout the course yeah. of the year? Yeah, yep. well, Blue Nights. And then the, the BigDamnRiverRun.com <laughs> has its own little thing. And some people are just going to want to send you some money because they know you're doing good with yes. it. And that's the address we where you can it. send we'll put um, into a good work. Send your checks or give them a call. Guys, thank you so much for coming in today. Thank you for having us. Thank you. Great to see you. Thanks. Thank All right.